Okay, Lynn, we're here. It's Kansas City. First time for the Paper Money Show here. It seems like a great success. Well, David, we just opened the doors. It's a little hard to say, but we got a nice crowd, nice, lots of exhibitors. They've come, you know, last night, the first person I talked to says, says, I came to buy three notes and I'm not going home without them. He says, where'd you, I said, where'd you come from? He said, Iraq. I said, really? You know, I said, I talked to another guy, he says, it was 25 and a half hours. He said, first I had to fly to Oslo, Norway to get a real plane. And he said, and then we came to New York and then here. But uh, they've come, they've come from all over the world. They're having fun. Last night we sold World Bank notes. They did, we had a wonderful session. Uh, the PCGS banquet, I got to sneak out there. I hope you get an interview from them because it was a great job. They had a great time playing trivia, eating fried chicken, and uh, so everything's good. Seems like we're off to a good start. People like the venue, people like the city. So yeah. And how about lectures? There are a half dozen lectures? Today, we, today, Friday and Saturday, there's a total of about 10, 10 members to the speaker series. And they're gonna be talking about a variety of topics uh, all day, we've got uh, some fab fabulous exhibits. The uh, polymer exhibit put on by World Banknote Grading it has every type of polymer banknote issued in the world as of now. And it's a growing field, the notes are beautiful, and if you get an opportunity to come see it, it'd be great. Then we've put on the Dr. Richard Bodie World Banknote Exhibit with a note from each of about 160 different countries. All that we pulled out of his collection to show to the public and we have a little scavenger hunt with it for, for youngsters and beginners and people that want to learn about that. Then we have the competitive exhibits. And then, out, you know, they're always wonderful. There's about 25 exhibitors and they're just out doing their thing. Then if you get to the over you go walk around the room there's also three or four tables on the boards floor that are a display of the most amazing five dollar brown bags you'll ever see there's like 55 different serial number one five dollar brown bags nobody's ever seen an exhibit like that they're from an uncut sheet from marlow oklahoma territory just all the way to arizona you know, we got that. It's there's something for everybody if they want to come. If they like paper money, if you want to learn something, you like history, you need to come to the show because it's fun and we make it. It's certainly affordable for anybody once you get here. It doesn't cost much to get in. It might cost a lot to get out. That's all I got to tell you. But you can have some fun.